briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2005, the Mississippi Supreme Court heard the case of Stodgehill v. State, focusing on the defense of necessity and the defendant's responsibility to prove that their actions were the only reasonable alternative in a situation of imminent danger. The case involved George Stodgehill, who was convicted of driving under the influence of alcohol while taking his sick girlfriend, Carla Kenny, to the hospital after a weekend spent with their adult children at a country cabin. The decision to drive came after several unsuccessful attempts to call an ambulance due to poor cell reception. The Court of Appeals initially overturned Stodgehill's conviction, but the Supreme Court later reversed this decision, stating that the trial court's original judgment was correct. The court ruled that Stodgehill failed to prove the defense of necessity, as there were adequate alternatives to driving while intoxicated, such as waiting for the ambulance or asking someone else to drive. The court was also concerned about allowing the defense of necessity in DUI cases, as it could potentially encourage individuals to justify endangering the public due to their own irresponsible drinking. Ultimately, the Mississippi Supreme Court affirmed the trial court's judgment of conviction for driving under the influence and reversed the Court of Appeals decision, setting a precedent for future cases involving the defense of necessity. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.